Jesus Christ, it's hot. I'm telling you now, if you're in La if you're in England, you're watching 17th of the 6th, 2021. It is hot. Leave a comment down below. You tell me where you are. Is it flipping up? Because it's like 12 o'clock at night and it's hot here. Um, I've got the fan next to me, but I can't pull it on because it distorts the mic. But it is what it is. Let's move on to this article. This article is pretty interesting as well. So, yeah, here we are. Uh, Ninersnation.com. Um, which is by uh, Jazz Kang. Uh, Project Ing Nick Bosa's extension with the 49ers. Uh, Donovan defensive lineman can sign a new deal after 2021 Ooh, okay so let's have a read nick bose's impact on the 49ers defense during the 2019 season was uh, elevated from the get-go the 2019 season overall pick came in and dominated from the uh, elevating the niners pass rush into one of the most profound in the nfl bose put up great numbers uh, in his rookie year finishing with nine sacks 47 tackles uh, including 16 for a loss uh, in route to winning the nfl's uh, defensive rookie of the year uh, most of the awards over in the past 10 years are among the best defense players in the league or on the downside of the impressive careers other than Ketchy, who's retired uh, 2011, Von Miller, 2012, Luke Kedridge, uh, 2013, Sheldon Richardson, 2014, uh, Aaron, Arn, uh, Aaron Donald, 2015, Marcus Peters, 2016, Joey Bosa, 2017, uh, Martian Lipmore, 2018, Darius Leonard, 2019, Nick Bosa, and 2020 was Chase Young. Unfortunately, Bosa tore his ACL early in the second quarter of the Niners' Week 2 win over the New York Jets last season. It was devastating blow to the defense line. Giants rebound from losing DeForest, uh, DeForest Buckner. Still, Bose is confident that he'll bounce back better than ever next season. If the 23-year-old has a similar impact in 2021 as he did rookie season, general manager John Lynch and co. will need to back the Brinks truck to keep him in 49ers. Uh, the four highest paid defense players in the NFL are Joey Bosa, 27 million, Miles Grant, 25 Kiel Matt 23.5, Aaron Donald 22.5 million. Grant signed his deal with the uh, Cleveland Browns on July 15th last year, making him the highest paid defensive player in the league. The latest for a little more than two weeks. Uh, Joey Bosa linked the mega deal with the Chargers on August 1st, taking the little uh, taking the title from Grant as has been the case in the NFL. The next great player at a particular position will always get a bigger contract. Bosa is a special talent who should return to being one of the game's best defensive lineman. He'll be uh, eligible to sign the extension next offseason. Uh, with tight end George Kittle's cap hit increasing by roughly 10.5 million in 2022 and all pro linebacker Fred Warner up for an extension now, the 49ers brace will need to get creative to not cap out the team once Bosa's signs. The salary cap for 2021 is set, uh, is set at 182.5 million. The pandemic's uh, economic fallout caused the NFL's uh, finances to take a major hit still the league intends on having full stadiums next season which along the new tv deals will result in a significant jump in the cap in the coming years san francisco could take a similar approach to what the kansas city Chiefs did for their mega deals with patrick mahomes and chris jones uh the chiefs have uh, the chiefs heavily backloaded their contracts so their cap hit and value will go up once the league's finalizes stables for the 49ers quarterback jimmy g's contract is strug uh, is structured so that the team will only have a dead cap hit of 1.4 million if the Niners decide to move on from him after 2021. So that will free up so uh, some much needed space under the salary cap going forward. Even under uh, optical uh, circumstances, it's hard to see Bosa eventually coming the highest paid defense player in the league. With his brother Joey's contract with an average of $27 million, it's easy to see Nick could get something in the ballpark of $30 million whenever he signs a new deal. What do you think will be the terms of Bose's extension? Well, um, here's the thing. Number one, how would he do good this season? You don't know, ladies and gentlemen. We have not a clue wherever you are in the internet world. We haven't got a clue. We're hoping he can do a full season. If he can do a full season with being all right, then I can't see being a 30 million, you know, extends $30 million. He did really well in 2019, really well. He kicked ass for us big time, big time. Probably the best players we've got so far. One of the best players we've got so far in defensive line. So, yeah, if he does well this season, I can't see him being a minimum of 30, maximum probably 35 million if he does well. But we will see. Uh, leave your comments down below. Tell me what you think, guys. 
Should we have him for the extension? Pfft. Stupid question, but yeah. Um, how much do you reckon? How long for the extension? Leave your comments down below. Tell me what you think. Thank you very much for the 38 subscribers. Really fortunate, really humble uh, for you guys to subscribe. And if you are new, subscribe. So there's a lot more 49ers news and other bits as well. Uh, trying to get out and along uh, along the way on this channel. So, uh, yeah, once again, thank you very much uh, for watching, guys. And I'll see you guys uh, on the next video.